Hey guys, Ignition Land Services here. Gonna talk to you about our uh, newly uh, developed trailer called Airbase One. Uh, after thousands of acres of sweating out in the Texas heat, we uh, put our brains to some pen and paper and decided to make things a little more efficient. Uh, starting out, we've got two hose reels here. I'll talk about how those feed off of the two cones in the back. A 725 gallon tank. Uh, these trailers can be customized and we've got different tank options and uh, different gear that you can put on here uh, to make sure that it fits your needs and what you're trying to get accomplished. So power management and plumbing, all of the plumbing and power management is plumbed under uh, through a breaker box, uh, ran off of one of the uh, generators on the trailer. It offers a great clean workspace. It offers safety so that you're not tripping over anything uh, while you're trying to get the job done and allows you to focus on the task at hand. Moving on back to the back of the trailer back here, uh, this particular setup that we have runs a dual cone system. Uh, these are two 80 gallon tanks. And what this allows you to do is if uh, the job warrants it, you can have both of these cones running at the same time uh, while one drains and the other one's ready to go. And then you start working off the second cone, off the second hose reel, and you can start mixing another one, offering uh, zero downtime when it comes to mixing and being more efficient. You'll notice that we have all the wiring here. We have our mixing uh, with the red levers here and then our water, uh, our water switch. So what this does is we don't have to worry about any cross contamination into our freshwater tank. There's absolutely no way for anything to backflow into our clean water tank, offering you always to have a clean water supply. Pacer pumps, uh, driven by some good electric motors, something that's reliable. You can leave these things running all day long. They're not gonna blow out. Chemical's not gonna burn them out. They're real rebuildable, rebuildable with the Viton seals. It's awesome. Uh, got our station if you're running an XAG uh, and you need a place to put your, um, uh, your RTK station and your DL1. It all mounts right here. We have a pole that goes up, can't extend it up here in the shop, but uh, offers a great place to keep all that organized out of the way where it's not gonna get bumped and uh, shifted off the deck, so. Space back here, right now we have our four wheeler. Uh, we always found that uh, having something to be able to go and, and map and retrieve and uh, create a proper map and be able to go retrieve the drone if needed or run a battery out to it because sometimes that happens. We have space for a pretty decent size, full size four wheeler here. Uh, we usually run a tank on this so that we can make some cleanup work or doing like entrances or something like that to add some final touches to a property. This space offers enough room to put a tote or a pallets of chemical, uh, keeping everything organized and it opens up an area for your workspace for mixing into the cones. Moving further around, uh, yeah, the drone gets the job done, uh, but your generator is the heart of the operation. Uh, we have the Kubota 1100 Low Boy, uh, 11,000 uh, mounted here on the side of the trailer uh, on a custom built uh, skid that we made for it to be able to uh, balance it on the trailer and be safely transported down the road. The breaker box, as you see, everything's sent down underneath the deck of the trailer, just like the plumbing. Everything's wired up. This generator is uh, powering both pumps for the mixing and then our freshwater transfer pump as well. And it also has the capability to have all of that running, charging the drone, and then keeping you nice and comfortable uh, on those hard working days. Quick feel, uh, sometimes you need to grab water quick or you're maybe running crops for a producer or something like that and we need to do a transfer in. Uh, offers you to bung up and uh, Take, a, take water off of a nurse trailer uh, and quick fill back into your own trailer. Coming up the ramp here into the command center, uh, this is all customizable. It comes as an empty shell. You can put desks in here, uh, toolboxes, uh, offers a safe place to keep your drone and equipment uh, so that you're not having to worry about when you stop at a hotel at night when you're out on the road, anybody or any peering eyes wondering what you got in here with your priceless equipment. The floor is uh, fully washable, uh, chemical stain resistant uh, so that you can flush out anything. We try not to store herbicides in here or anything like that, but obviously the drone is sometimes going to have a chemical in it and uh, we'll need to be able to wash this out and keep a clean space. Right now we got a foldable table in here, but 
Uh, eventually we'll have a table uh, where we can operate the drone if needed when you've got a handler outside, uh, store equipment, get paperwork done. Uh, TVs will go in here so the customers can observe what the drone's doing and they get to sit in a climate controlled area because uh, a lot of customers like to hang out with you and, and experience this technology for themselves. So, lighting, power, uh, of course the AC unit to keep you cool, like I said. Uh, it gets pretty hot, especially if you're out in the summer doing uh, brush work. And uh, I think this trailer offers a lot to the Texas applicator or any applicator out there uh, trying to get kind of the best of both worlds while operating in the cab of a tractor while getting work done. And I think this is a great, uh, a great uh, addition to uh, any type of operation that you guys are trying to get involved in. And I'd love to call, uh, love for you to give us a call, and we could answer any questions and build one out for you and get you taken care of and get you down the road. So, also the final touch is uh, another access door, a man door, and this provides a way for you to get in, maintain things without having to drop the bay door every single time. So. Once again, it's Justin Hale with Ignition Land Services. Give us a shout. Your vision is our passion. Thank you.